People have inhabited the Amazon rainforest for at least 10,000 years now. While some scientists estimate even 39,000 years. But when you have massive civilizations of up to 60 million people, you must feed them somehow, maybe. It would be easy if they had Amazon fresh. <laughs> But the Amazon rainforest only had shitty soils like this, which definitely wouldn't have been able to support these big civilizations. Turns out the solution was quite simple. While the archaeologists aren't 100% sure, it seems like the indigenous people just burned some stuff, made charcoal and amended the soil with it. Turning this piece of trash into one of the most fertile soils in the world, known as Terra Preta, or Amazon Dark Soil. As the scientists were doing research, they were finding patches of land with this soil all over the rainforest, with sizes ranging from 1 to around 100 acres. You might be asking, well what's so special about adding charcoal into the soil other than making it look dark as hell? I am glad that you've asked. University studies have shown that adding charcoal, also called biochar, to soil increases the soil's water holding capacity, reduces soil density, and has been proven to reduce soil nutrient leaching, but you've clicked on this video to discuss discover something about the ancient farms, didn't you? Okay, let me tell you a secret. Come closer. A little bit more. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Okay, nice. The whole Amazon rainforest is a millennia old agriculture experiment that just got a bit out of hand. As I talked about the millions of people living in this thick ass jungle, didn't it seem strange to you? Like, did all the people crawl through bushes their whole life? Apparently, before people inhabited it, the jungle wasn't anything like today. And when the people came, they started doing stuff with the soil, farming and so on. Then, about 8000 years ago, they really got into domesticating plants. So it turns out that about 20% of all the plants and trees in Amazonia are domesticated. And it spikes to 30% in areas where there were ancient cities. There is actually evidence of corn, cassava, sweet potatoes and squash being grown in the Amazon rainforest thousands and thousands of years ago. So the civilizations flourished and shit and then Spaniards came. In the 1540s Francisco de Orleana crossed the whole South American continent from shore to shore, sailing on the Amazon River, and reported advanced civilizations with big cities. He died on his second expedition, but when other explorers came one century after him, they couldn't find any of it. The most likely theory is that the Spaniards brought smallpox, which totally annihilated the indigenous populations. Nobody took care of the domesticated agroforest and the jungle took over the cities. So they vanished forever. Or maybe not because thanks to deforestation we were able to find things like these and thanks to LIDAR scientists were able to rediscover some of the centuries lost cities. Would you like to use a time machine and see these civilizations flourish? Let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching.